Have you ever heard of Noble Drew Ali, the founder of the Moorish Science Temple of America? This is the story of Timothy Drew, a man of many names and many more mysteries. Known to many as Noble Drew Ali, he is the founder of the Moorish Science Temple of America. His life, shrouded in mystery, is a testament to the power of faith and the impact one man can have on the world. Let's delve into the fascinating life and teachings of this influential figure. Noble Drew Ali's early life is shrouded in mystery and filled with intriguing stories. Born as Timothy Drew his beginnings are clouded with uncertainties. Some accounts suggest he was orphaned others hint at Cherokee heritage. There's even a tale of a harsh upbringing with an abusive aunt, leading him to seek solace among the Romani people. These nomadic wanderers exposed him to a world beyond his immediate surroundings. His early experiences would later shape his spiritual journey. Drew Ali's spiritual awakening is said to have begun during his travels in Egypt. There, he reportedly encountered a high priest of Egyptian magic who recognized him as a reincarnation of several religious figures. Drew Ali was seen not just as a modern-day prophet, but as a living embodiment of Jesus, Buddha, and Muhammad, each in their turn. This was a transformative moment for him, a revelation that would shape the rest of his life and the lives of many others. But the high priest did more than just recognize Drew Ali, he handed him a lost section of the Quran. This sacred text, previously hidden from the world, would become the foundation of the Holy Quran of the Moorish Science Temple of America. It was in these ancient words that Drew Ali found the inspiration to create a new religious movement. This was the beginning of Drew Ali's unique religious ideology. Drew Ali's teachings were revolutionary, challenging the accepted narratives of race and religion. He introduced a unique perspective on identity, asserting that the sons and daughters of the Asiatic nation of North America had fallen from grace. This was a call to reclaim their ancestral heritage and dignity. In a radical departure from mainstream views, he claimed that Jesus and his followers were not of European descent but were, in fact, Asiatic, a term that he used to unify diverse non-European peoples. Equally potent was his assertion that African Americans were not merely descendants of enslaved Africans, but were Moors, hailing from the ancient Moabites. This he believed connected them to a grand narrative of civilization that stretched back millennia, offering a source of pride and a sense of belonging. In the year 1913 Drew Ali planted the seeds of his vision with the establishment of the Canaanite Temple in Newark. As his following grew, the temple migrated to various cities including Philadelphia, Washington DC and Detroit. But it was in the bustling city of Chicago in the year 1925 that the Moorish Science Temple found its home. The following year, Temple No. 9 was officially registered, marking an important milestone in the growth of Drew Ali's movement. Drew Ali's movement was growing, but it was not without its challenges. Noble Drew Ali's influence didn't end with his death. The internal strife within the Moorish Science Temple of America did not dissolve with his passing. Instead, it escalated into a power struggle, with various candidates vying to fill the vacuum left by Drew Ali's departure. His arrest and subsequent death stirred a significant shift within the temple, sparking a battle for leadership that would shape its future. Notwithstanding these internal conflicts, Drew Ali's teachings lived on his ideology serving as a foundational pillar for later movements. One such movement was the Nation of Islam, some dispute the connection, yet it is undeniable that the nation shared similar ideologies, particularly the assertion of a distinct identity for African Americans. Moreover, Drew Ali's teachings transcended the borders of the United States, extending as far as North Africa. In 1986, Morocco formally recognized the Moorish Science Temple's Islamic linkage, acknowledging the global influence of Drew Ali's ideology. Even today, the Moorish Science Temple of America stands as a testament to Drew Ali's teachings. His ideals of unity and self-identity continue to inspire followers, shaping their worldview and sense of self. His teachings remain a beacon for those seeking to understand their heritage and identity, offering a unique perspective on the African-American experience. Noble Drew Ali's life, teachings and legacy continue to resonate today, shaping the Moorish Science Temple of America and beyond. Before we wrap up this captivating journey through the life and legacy of Noble Drew Ali, we urge you to ring the bell like and subscribe for more fascinating tales like this one. Your engagement not only supports us in bringing more of such intriguing historical narratives but also ensures that you don't miss out on any future videos. Our upcoming content will delve deeper into the various movements influenced by the Moorish Science Temple's teachings and the global impact of Drew Ali's ideology. 
we'll be exploring the Nation of Islam's connections with the Temple, the recognition by Morocco, and the ripple effects it had worldwide. We will also be spotlighting other influential figures who have shaped the African-American experience throughout history. So, stay tuned for more intriguing tales from history, and remember each like, share, and subscription helps us in making these narratives accessible to a wider audience. Thank you for your support and for joining us on this historical journey.